versus me. But in order to fully understand the song that's about to be ministered, I must share with y'all how good God is. I've been a really member for a long time, and I love praising God through dance. But most importantly, I love that my mom shares the same passion. I remember the first time that we mimed together. The song was called I Worship You by Mary Mary. My mom made this practice nonstop until we had the moves almost perfect. One thing to know about my mom is when she's serious about something, she always gives her all. Watching her growth in the mind ministry helped strengthen my growth. And ministering together helped strengthen our bond. After years and years of miming together, everything seemed to be going well until 2020. In the middle of 2020, my mom's health fell over. She was diagnosed with restrictive lung disease. For those who do not know what that is, it is a disease that makes it difficult for the lungs to expand completely, making it harder to inhale. Sometimes her breathing was so bad that just walking a few steps made her winded, thus limiting what she could do. But even through my mom's health problems, she never stopped coming to my practice, and she never stopped proclaiming that God is good. Hallelujah. For months, she sat in a chair watching us practice for hours, praying that the Lord would strengthen her lungs just enough to mind again. The Bible says in Matthew chapter 21, verse 22, if you believe, you will receive whatever you ask for in prayer. The Bible also says in Psalms chapter 37, verse 4, to delight yourself in the Lord, and he will give you the desires of your heart. I believe because of the countless prayers and her desires to want to minister again, God strengthened her lungs, not just enough, but more than enough to minister with us today. My mom, she's a living testament that God answers prayers, and no matter what your current situation is, Always remember that God is still good.
made your bandits cruel.